Two rare pieces of Tupac memorabilia, which come from his 11-month prison stay, are now up for sale. The late artist did time at the Clinton Correctional Facility in New York on sexual abuse charges, and was eventually released in October of 1995 after appealing his conviction. His previously unseen booking photo, as well as his prison ID card, will soon belong to a lucky fan. That is, as long as they're willing to pay a hefty price. Momentsintime.com has listed the booking photo for $35K. The ID card, which was a replacement of his original, is going for $75K. Whoever ends up getting their hands on the ID card will also receive a handwritten note penned by Tupac himself. It'll come with the form Tupac filled out asking for another ID after losing his old one. I lost my ID and need a new one. Thank you, it reads alongside his famous signature. Rare Tupac memorabilia available for purchase. Tupac's 1995 prison ID and booking photo are now for sale. Tupac Shakur during party for cowboy noir thriller Red Rock West at Club USA in New York City, New York, United States. Photo by Ron Galella slash Ron Galella Collection by Getty Images. According to TMZ, the items were given to one of Tupac's family members when he was released. They later made their way into the possession of a collector, who's now willing to part with them. A few years back, the artist's original prison ID went up for auction and eventually sold for $30,000. With all the Tupac talk happening due to Keith D's recent arrest, it's safe to say that the items will go quick. Earlier this month, it was also announced that Gotta Have Rock and Roll will be auctioning off two old mugshots of Tupac and the notorious B.I.G. in November. Rare footage of Biggie's final concert, said to be in pristine condition, will also go to the highest bidder. The two Polaroids are expected to bring in roughly $40,000 each, while the rare footage is expected to bring in up to $2 million. What do you think of Tupac's booking photo and prison ID card going up for sale? Share your thoughts in the comments section down below.